Hello, in this Steam Deck video, I'm going to show you Grand Theft Auto 3 on P PCSX2, so the PlayStation 2 version, and it works great. If you want to have 30 frames per second, you can limit that in the Steam settings, or you just do 60 frames and it runs really smooth. So, I'm just using the settings from the setup video of PCSX2 that I made. There's a link to that in the description, so feel free to follow with that. And yeah, it just works. So one thing I would say, in the menu, go to display, enable widescreen. That will, that's the only other thing that I would recommend doing within the game itself. And apart from that, we can start playing. So I've already started a little bit and I'll play a bit more so you can see the performance and some gameplay. Oh, this game brings back memories. I've still got to get the... What's it called? The, the remastered version that they released a few months ago. Still need to get that. I wouldn't mind a modern GTA, I mean like a new GTA for the new graphics, new gameplay mechanics for setting London, because that, that old GTA London back in the day, that side one, but <laughs> from the old GTA you just get money for doing literally anything, whereas in like in GTA 5 you don't get money for doing these random ass missions like this, saying that it was essentially a job for Luigi that April did say he was going to get paid for, but still, $1,500? I mean, I'll do that. <coughs> Luigi said to, to give you this, so here, here, take it. I'll skip some of the cutscenes so you can see more, you know, actual gameplay. Bats just literally on the street. Go through the gap. That's all it took. Do not want to hit that cop car. Remember back in the day, if you just hit them lightly, they would come after you. And sometimes if you hit them head on, it was really hard. They wouldn't come after you. So annoying when they would just end up hitting you whilst you're just driving a little bit. You know, this is going to become a whole thing now. Damn right, better be free, I'm paying a thousand dollars. And that's still pretty decent to my, that's still pretty decent, at least in today's time to get a whole new thing job on the car.
Yeah, like another two thousand dollars. Four thousand dollars. <laughs> Rob that car in front of the cops. He's gonna give me some money. Nah, no money, unfortunately. They say he doesn't like to walk. <laughs> Just please. I expected that by enough D2 actually get through it. Oh, can you get through get the car? Yeah, I guess it's pretty good, but that's pretty fun. The piss misty does. Uh, that was like a full on head on collision. Where'd he go? He's eject. The police car death. <laughs> Do a mission for Joey. I miss the, you know, the mini map from the new uh, open world game where they actually give you direction, like a line to follow. Those days, I mean, these days are blessed compared to those days. You can just try and figure stuff out. Sometimes you would open the bigger map just to see if you're actually even going in the right way or you're going to head into a dead end. Outside. It's with the lights as well. 
And then something I remember was reversing that exactly hit in the cop car. Ooh, what did he drop? Money or a gun? Oh, disappeared. This going up here. Literally at the end here. Watch the explosion. Apparently, they don't care. There's the car next to him that's all banged up, smoke coming out. But according to the new GTA, they had some feature like that, and the mission would dynamically change. That's a result. <laughs> you did. Ten thousand dollars. Ah, he's gonna explode as well. He was due to explode. Uh, before I wrap up, I'm see if I can remember the command for the cheats. Was it? I want, I want, I want to. Oh no, it wasn't there. I'm just gonna quickly Google the cheats. R2, R2, I want R2, left, down, right, up, left, down, right, up. Yes. Let's have some fun now. Oh, I better dip. I need help. Oh, 
Where is it? I really do want to get this. Oh, yeah. Ah, and I died. <laughs> Only got to four, not six stars. So, yeah, so that's it. Gameplay of GTA 3 on the Steam Deck via the PCSX2 emulator runs fine. And if you like the video, give it a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button. Let me know in the comments what video and gameplay you'd like to see next. And there's a link in the description to a Steam compatibility list I'm compiling and all the recommended settings for different games. And that's it. Thanks for watching and I'll see you soon. Bye bye.